Watch and Mortgage Market Update. I'm Bob Gibbs. And I'm Michael Karras. And we're in July 2021. What happened to 2020? We it skipped. just disappeared. <laughs> Poof. <laughs> yeah, we're going to leave 2020 behind us. Yes. Thank God. Except I wish I could leave a little more. Talk about the freshman <laughs> 15. How about the Corona 30? <laughs> yeah. We have uh, a while to take care of it. <laughs> Um, so we want to bring you an update of what's going on in the current market and with real estate and with the mortgage and with the real estate market, you know, unless you've been living in a hole, you probably have noticed that it's a strong seller's market. Homes are selling well over asking price. And it's interesting that it's not just the, what we consider lower end properties here. Right. It's, uh, luxury properties as well, 3 million plus are getting multiple offers. Uh, it's amazing. It's yeah. amazing. The disposable cash available out there. Yeah. It's, it's, uh, it's just a crazy time we're in and, and the interesting thing about that is uh, I get questions all the time about when's the bubble going to burst. And really, this isn't a bubble. Yeah. There's, a, there's that much demand, believe it or not. And uh, people are coming from the peninsula who are getting outbid over there. Yeah, They're coming over to the East Bay. And even though the prices are gone skyrocketing here, it's still a bargain compared to yeah, you the get, peninsula yeah, area. I think you get more house, you get more yard. Yeah, uh, I mean, great schools. Yeah, yeah, Everything unbelievable schools, facilities yeah. for the kids. Yeah, I mean, and, and but the key to everything and this whole and why we think it's going to continue is the work at home environment. Now it doesn't right. matter where you work. Yeah, you work from right. home, and so that's where you see a lot of families flocking to the East Bay from the peninsula, San Francisco specifically. Right, right. it's crazy. Right, yeah. There's been a lot of talk about a mass exodus out of California, and while in general there's been a net loss. It hasn't been in our area. Yeah, <laughs> it's been people moving from one county to the next. Exactly. And uh, in Contra Costa and Alameda, our um, population numbers are actually higher than they were a year and a half ago. So um, it depends on where you're where you're at. Uh, so the that's where real estate market is. Uh, how, how's the mortgage market look? Well, if you were been living on this planet, yeah, <laughs> you would know that rates, uh, into mortgage rates over the last year have been at all time lows. I mean, we funded loans in the 2% range, right. numerous, numerous, at all types of loan amounts, big loan amounts, small loan amounts. So it's been phenomenal from that standpoint, tons of people refinancing, pulling out cash out of their homes, improving their homes, and then right. putting them on the market and getting 15 and 20% over the asking right. price. So right. it, it's been a perfect storm for anybody that's owned, and it probably is more likely it's gonna continue because rates will stay down. I mean, it's, we've gotten some of the worst uh, inflationary readings in decades over the past two weeks. But with that said, the Fed, Fed Chairman Brown, uh, Fed Chairman Powell, I mean, he feels like it's uh, the Fed thinks it's a more of a temporary thing. It, right. It's uh, not a sustainable, and they're just going to take a wait and see approach. So for the fact that they're taking a wait and see approach to these crazy inflationary numbers, that means mortgage rates are going to stay down for the four, you know, in the next few for at least a few months. Who knows? I would say into next year. So, I mean, if you haven't refinanced, if you haven't bought, this would be the time because it's still, the opportunities are yeah. still there. Yeah, like we were saying, um, it's uh, uh, the best hedge against inflation in terms of housing is to buy a home with a fixed rate mortgage for 30 years. And you look back uh, two or three years from now when we see a lot more inflation, you'll be, you'll be really happy that you did. I mean, think of the celebrations when we hit 6% single digit fixed rate uh, fixed rates, and now we're in the threes. Right. Uh, we're, we're right now hovering around that three percent range. I mean, right. it's crazy how how much money is going towards the principal and not interest in these mortgage payments on the, from the start. Actually, right, right. So that's where we're at today. And um, give us a call if you have any questions regarding the market, either mortgages or real estate in general. Yes, and uh, we'll be back soon. Bye.